Australia could face France, Denmark, and Tunisia at the World Cup. Australia could face France, Denmark, and Tunisia at the 2022 World Cup if they navigate their way past United Arab Emirates and Peru in qualifying playoffs over the summer, Friday's draw has confirmed. The Soxaroos missed out on automatic qualification for this year's showpiece, which gets underway in Qatar on November 21. Graham Arnold's side finished third in Asian qualifying Group B after winning just four of their ten qualifying fixtures, yet that means they are still in with a chance of reaching the tournament. To do so, they must first get past Group A's third-place Team UAE in a fourth-round fixture on June 7, which is taking place in Doha, the Qatari capital, three months later than scheduled due to the disruptive effect of the COVID-19 pandemic. Should they emerge victorious from that tie, Australia will then lock horns with Peru, who finished fifth in CONMEBOL qualifying, in an intercontinental playoff on June 13-14. The winner of that playoff will book their place in Qatar, and on Friday all three teams still in contention discovered their potential World Cup opponents. Having been seeded in pot four, which includes the lowest-ranked teams, either Australia, UAE or Peru were drawn in Group D alongside Denmark, Tunisia and reigning world champions France, despite losing their last two matches against Japan and Saudi Arabia and missing out on direct qualification as a result, Football Australia have confirmed that Arnold will remain in his position as head coach until the end of Australia's World Cup campaign. Arnold, who has spent four years in charge of the Soxaroos, is being offered short-term stability in the role after a miserable return of just six points from their last seven qualifying matches plunged his future into doubt. But chair of Football Australia Chris Niku said on Wednesday, the board of Football Australia believed it was important that we provided a stable environment and to get on with planning for the playoff phase, given the very short turnaround. By confirming that Graham will remain head coach of the Soxaroos until the completion of our FIFA World Cup Qatar 2022 campaign, it enables Graham, his support staff and the playing group to move forward with certainty and without delay to ensure the best possible preparation for the next phase of qualification.